hello my dear darlings my dear subscribers thank you so much for your likes and thank you for sharing my video to your friends these videos can be helpful for someone who is starting low carb diet or who is already on keto diet some new tips some new ideas from my own experience and for experience with my customers so today will be video about keto morning when you wake up what is the easiest thing we can do for keto breakfast and with what we start our keto day so first of all keto day we are starting with water first of all it is water and you can have one liter of water in the morning directly or you can have 500 milliliters or this is for me is 700 milliliters so i'm just putting my water for me first thing in the morning to help my body to wake up and to very important to start with water i am having here 700 milliliters then some people is uh, happy to do morning water together with lemon juice so we are taking lemon we are get cutting half of it and we are extracting the lemon juice in such kind of utensil so we got some lemon juice and when we have lemon water in the morning we already ensuring that we consuming vitamin c because in keto diet we do not indulge in fruits actually we don't eat too much fruits fruits is having fructose which is preventing us to go into ketosis so what we do we have some berries if we want to replace fruits we may replace it by berries so to start date with the lemon water is the best thing because you are refreshing yourself you are giving to yourself vitamin c and as well lemon is the best alkalizer best natural alkalizer so many times i'm hearing oh i can't have lemon because it's acidic so many people is afraid of lemon because it's acidic and they're telling, oh, I have gastrite, I can't have lemons. But actually the secret of lemons is that when it's outside of our body, it is acidic. But when we put it inside our body, when we drink it, eat it, the actually lemon juice is becoming alkalizer it is natural alkalizer and it is neutralizing the stomach juices and it is alkalizing our stomach juices it is alkalizing our body so it is very helpful very useful very good for our health so it depends of your habits maybe sometimes if you are afraid of lemon or you are not friendly of lemon some people are telling that um, when they have lemon they start to have uh, different kind of symptoms so if you are afraid so you can put a few drops only no need to put half lemon in the water you just put few drops and this is your lemon water to start your keto morning after that make sure that 45 minutes gone or one hour gone then you starting then you go further for your keto breakfast and after you have drink your lemon water and one hour gone then it's time for our breakfast our keto breakfast with our bulletproof coffee then after one hour gone after we have drink lemon water one hour gone now it's time for our coffee the very easiest breakfast the most easiest also suitable for vegetarian i will show you now this is my coffee now I am adding little bit of MCT oil. It depends what your amount of allowed fats to be taken per day. Then you decide how many fats you will be consuming. You can put a bit of whipping cream. A bit did not happen. And we can put a bit of butter as well. I put I'm putting little butter, I will show you later why. And we are sh mixing it well. Mm -hmm. 
so this is my bulletproof coffee it's becoming very beautiful like milkshake okay now i'm going to drink this bulletproof coffee with what let me show you can use any cheese you know in keto diet we are allowed to eat cheese whatever cheese you like any kind of cheese okay and let me take i'm taking one slice of this cheese look at what i'm planning to do the cheese and i'm taking butter and i'm putting on the cheese or you can even put a slice so it is cheese butter cheese sandwich now if you want to make it if you wanted to make it even more tasty more exotic what we take we take this kind of cheese and we apply it again on that cheese which we have already prepared and look what will happen i'm rolling it like this and that's my cheese butter cheese sandwich which contain only cheese and butter and i will be having it with my coffee if this one is not enough you can have one more like this or two more like this it depends on your intake which amount of fat you are usually taking per day depend on your goal are you on maintenance or you are losing weight now again same thing i'm taking butter real butter applying on it you see i'm not afraid that's why in uh, coffee i did not put so much butter because i know i will be using butter now in sandwich I apply butter how much I needed and it is different for different for each individual maybe some people will need more butter per day than another but one of the biggest sign that you need more fats it is when you are even after keto food after eating keto meal you are still hungry it means fats are not enough because your body is functioning on fats as a main source of energy so you can add your fats there is a formula how to calculate how, how which amount of fats you need for the day and that will be my breakfast cup of coffee bulletproof coffee or it can be tea it's up to you and uh, i will have these two sandwiches but it is packed with butter and usually after such breakfast i will not be hungry for hours So my dear darling, that was our keto morning and keto breakfast. You can see it's very easy. The very fast and easy making bulletproof coffee with butter inside, with MCT oil inside. And you make your sandwiches with cheese, butter, cheese. You can see it's so fast. If you are in hurry, best keto breakfast. And the most important after such breakfast, you are not hungry for very long time. Guess why? Because fats are giving you nine calories per gram and it is holding you for more longer periods. And you are not craving for other things. You are not craving for your usual snacks. That is perfect things to do in the morning to start the day.